So you might be selling the club. Are they buying it just for this room? Because this is a very nice boardroom you got yourself here. When I'm, you know, sweating it out in the showers after the match, during training, and you're up here in the lofty heights with the nice background. Welcome back to Barry the Hatchet uh, with me, Coach Coot. Um, as you saw in the intro, uh, Chris Murray might potentially be selling the club. Um, so there's that to look forward to, maybe. We'll, we'll see what happens. Probably not going to happen, but it might. Um, if they're going to inject millions of pounds, I'm not going to object. Um, even if they just want to clear the debt and give us a little bit of money, that would be nice. Um, maybe upgrade some of the facilities, who knows. Um, but yeah, so since you were last year, we've only played one game. Um, and that was against Litherland, where we won 6-2. Um, so the boys are really coming into some kind of form now. This tactic seems to be the one where we score lots of goals. Um, it's still not great defensively, uh, so that's good. Um, but anyway, today, FA Bay's quarter final. Um, let's get into it. So, obviously, Lancaster is um, cup tied, he can't play. Uh, so, we're going to put uh, Gilboy in, but we're going to swap him for Healy. And Jepson King took up an injury in the last game. Uh, so Jenkinson is going to come in, we're going to have Arthur uh, on the sub and we'll bring in Joe Stanley uh, also as a sub. Um, other than that, no changes, we are still going with our 4-2-4 formation, uh, seems to be working pretty well for us, so um, why change what isn't broken, why fix what isn't broken even, that's a better way of saying that. Um, so hopefully today will just be a cakewalk. We'll just go out, score a couple of goals and uh, go home, call it a day, have a nice little bath. Um, so yeah, fingers crossed. This is against Kendall. Uh, they're not doing too well in the league. So uh, oh, that's not playing. Helps if I, helps if I press play. So off to a good start we've had a shot um i think we were domin already kind of dominating possession uh in the first 10 minutes of the game um however a ball to moncrief got intercepted and egan is bringing it forward and it's saved barely by ed um ed is now a leading regional premier divs player so he's one of the best goalkeepers in the league uh, so that's, that's pretty cool um, what isn't cool is that most of the highlights are for Kendall and they score <sighs> beaten at the back post it was kind of a a half decent corner but who, who, who's this Jenkinson standing there doing nothing because that's a good thing to do. And actually, we're getting wrecked. We are, we're being hammered right now in terms of shot ratio. Um, they've had three shots, all three on target. We've had three, none on target. Uh, but Williams picks up the ball, lumps it up to Moncrief, who passes back to David, uh, out to Williams on the wing. Gonna bring it inside, inside forward, obviously. Pass it for to Moncrief, who has a shot, and it's saved quite nicely, actually. I'm kind of a Superman save. So, McDavid with the corner. Can we make something of it? No. But Chippendale's going to pick up the loose ball, 
and it's tackled by the guy I was potentially going to sign. Um, but he's not as good as Moncrief, so we'll, we'll leave it. Um, let's get a bit more... I want to get more shouty, but I can't yet. Anyway, so Egan again coming forward with the ball. Uh, Blackford there on the wing, who just walks it right past. Uh, I, I can't remember who's playing that side. Uh, Valentine, it would be. So yeah, things are not looking good for us right now. Um, our, our FA Bay's run could be over again. Two years in a row. Uh, but good boy with it to Healy. Out to Chippendale. Come on, Chippendale. He can't get it in. That's half hour gone. And we're not looking great. Um, yeah, Kendall deserves to be ahead of us. But Chance now with a dangerous free kick from Chippendale who goes for it and over the crossbar. This is not... I mean, we should have scored, surely. Right? We're, we're very equal. Um, I'm not pleased at all. We, we need to be doing better. Um, we're not actually playing too badly. Jenkinson is letting the side down. Gilboy and Williams not doing amazing, but come on, Williams, no. So we are gonna we're gonna do an early sub. We're gonna take Jenkinson off, replace him with Stanley, and I don't. We're just gonna leave it. We're just gonna leave it for now and hope that somebody just gets that in the back of the net. Come on. No. That was like three shots there. Not a single one of them any good. But Kendall with a throw in. Are they going to deny us our dreams of an FA race final? McDavid bring it forward to Williams. Through to Healy. Somebody has to score, surely. Medavit with the corner, cleared by Dent, and Egan's going to sweep up that loose ball. Come on, not like this, please. Valentine wins it, and that's the end of the highlight. We have got the far better XG now, so why haven't we scored? Um, Medavit, Let, let's bring off Medavit for Joe Brett. Um, Gilboy, let's bring in Arthur and let's see if they can make the change. Those are our last two subs. So if it all goes to that's it. So Blackford with the ball. He's got options in the box. Out to Egan, who shot deflected or pass deflected. Anyway, Stanley wins the ball, but it goes quite poorly out. Right. Come on. Williams, that was a bad tackle there. Williams to the ball. Valentine in. Moncrief off the crossbar. Come on. This should be 3 1 now. Surely. We should be up 3 1. Right? The XG tells us that. Egan bringing it forward again with around 20 minutes left to play. Is this it? Are we over? Head scrambles it. That I mean that, that probably should have gone in. Um, come on, boys, please. Let's not go out like this. Valentine with the throw to Williams to Valentine into Brett. Oh, to Healy. Crossbar again. Keep it down. So that goes out for a corner. Healy to bring it in. Can we do it? Can we come back and win this? Because there's no extra time. It would just go straight to penalties. So Valentine lumps it up. And that's the end of the highlight. Stanley, throw in. Come on, somebody please do something positive. Just knock the ball into the between the posts. They're not small. This should be easy, even for a team of our calibre. 
Williams with it. Can he? Oh. Five minutes left. Did this. Right, Ed, start a counter attack. Come on. Chippendale. Tackled. Silver. Hughes. Forward to Ed, please. Well. It looks like that tenor I bombed to the referee did, a, did us a good job. But unfortunately. We're out. This tactic seems to be the one where we score lots of goals. Today will just be a cakewalk. We're out. How? How did how did we lose that? I just... Somebody help me out. How did, how did we lose that? We had an XG of nearly four compared to their two. Why did we not score any? We needed the trophy. That's two years in a row we've been solid in the FA base just to get knocked out by some really, really stupid game. We had 20 shots. about it but they kind of they understand um, but we, we we should have won that we should have won that so easily anyway maybe next year eh? um, I guess now it's a uh, it's all about the league so we are four points clear of Ron Town. So for next episode, the final episode of season two, um, we're going to come back for Ron Town and Afro, and we'll do the end of season review. Um, hopefully, we can still win the league. And we'll also catch up on what happens with the Port Takeover if it goes ahead. Um, so on that sour note, I'll say goodbye. I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. I'm gonna go have a cry in the shower.